Hi guys, good morning. Uh, yeah, very late into the party as always with me, uh, but it's the start of my uh, entry into Idic Beer's Terrain Square Circle uh, Terrain Competition. Um, so I've decided to try and go with an Orc Teleporter. Um, doesn't look like much at the moment. A little bit of uh, chicken wire and a few bits of plastic card and bits of terrain and stuff stuck to what was part of a uh, let me get this right, a Carl Lewis uh, cross trainer, <laughs> which uh, no longer is in my possession. And um, yep, so we've got some various bits there. Stuck a little lift to get up to the teleporter for the little guys there. Uh, stuck underneath. We'll see if we that way up. Like that. Um, yep, into there, and um, a little piece of hose there. Um, maybe there's some power cables or something, and then the pad itself. And then we've got the control station, which I shall show you now. Okay, and here we have the start of the control station, which is like the gun which produces the power which creates the teleportation. Uh, just a cake board. Um, luckily my wife makes cakes for a living, so no shortage of cake boards in my house. And then we've got a control station there, which is going to have, I'll show you later, uh, a little walk sitting on top of there, controlling the whole show. And a little bit of flooring, just all made out of plastic card and bits, and then I've got some glyphs and various bits of stuff all stuck around the outside to make it look as ramshackle as possible. And these are the legs from the Sky Shield landing pad, um, but I didn't use the legs on my Sky Shield pad um, as you, last year's terrain competition. Uh, I sit it on top of some rocky formation and a bunker. Um, and here we've got a fan from an old uh, computer uh, with the vents on the side, a little ramp which is the back of a truck, I believe. Going over some, that's not glued down yet, I don't know if that's going to go there. Some tubing, um, another part of an old dishwasher or washing machine cable going up. A little platform there with a little ladder going in for some maintenance. And then there's the gun itself, which creates the ray for the teleportation. Uh, polystyrene ball, uh, the second bit here. Is a wheel from a uh, from that running machine or that cross trainer. A couple of pieces, not sure what they're from. Uh, possibly battle wagons. Uh, a cap from a washing liquid bottle, and then this is part of the comms relay. I think it, is. it comes with the Aegis defence line glued on there. Um, yeah, and that's hopefully making my teleportation thing. And then we've got various. Uh, like telegraph poles, I suppose you call them, or uh, power cables with the power lines running, and all going into the control panel on the the control deck there, and then up to the gun, then down, then here into the fan, and then hopefully here I'm going to have uh, a fuel source, maybe a, an old tin can or something like that. It's going to be the where the fuel comes from, with a few barrels scattered around it and various bits. And then I'll show you the guy sitting in the control seat. Hi right, guys, and then here we should have the guy who's going to be the orc sitting in the control seat. So it's an orc gunner guy sitting in the, what's the bit off the back of the truck, I think it is. There's the wrecking ball on it. And I've glued the top of a DACA jet to the back and some exhausts on the side from a DACA jet. Um, to make him look like he's in a powered hot seat. That's going to be fixed to that bottle cap thing there. And then, if you want focus, and we're going to have some legs from, I think it's from the Icarus Array cannon from the Aegis line. Um, something like this. I'm not sure exactly on the spacings. Something like that, glued around as stabilising legs. And then out the front here, my idea 
is to have a large crane piece coming out uh, which then controls the power levels of the uh, of the uh, teleporter so it's all over the place at the moment so here you can see it all in its various stages I'm imagining the teleporter is going to be the deck is going to be somewhere in front there like that um, yeah I'll keep you posted, I'm going to crack on painting and uh, see how far I can get and uh, I'll speak to you soon. Cheers guys.